this is this way, it's a two star problem at Hobson Moor. So this was a climb that caught my eye probably about three or four years ago. I'm sure people can relate, it was one of them climbs where I tried and basically couldn't even pull off the start move. The whole rock face is actually at a slight angle, so your left foot starts in this little position a bit higher up, and a little nubble you have to kind of twist onto on your right foot, and there's a really kind of poor layback uh, for your hands to, at the start. Uh, I did start with putting a few mats on top of each of us, um, just to change the angle a little bit so I can get used to the move. I found what was crucial was my right leg. Um, I put the small little hold on the outside of my foot and I had to really drop the knee down and then just kind of fling up with my left hand to get the uh, next hold. This was the first time I've ever actually managed to get up off the ground off it, uh, so it's really uh, good to see that my training routine I've recently put in is really working. And I watched some people, um, some people's clips doing it, and they always kind of move their right hand above here to readjust their left hand, but this just was not working for them. I figured I could get into this position, so I thought I'd just try the uh, top bit out. Well, it's funny, if I go back like even like half a year, I wouldn't even be able to pull on uh, these two, let alone haul myself up on them. It was a little committing move to a uh, cut loose. So now I thought I'd just take a minute and see if I can link it all together. 